Hispanics programs in Germany, Sanger called for the implementation of such programs in the United States, specifically targeting African Americans. The following editorial was published in the 1932 issue of the Birth Control Review. The Negro problem is one of the most complicated and important confronting America. Whatever the ultimate answer may be, such an attitude brings to light the function of birth control as a necessary agency in its solution. The present submerged condition of the Negro is due in large part to the high fertility of the race under disastrously adverse circumstances. Thus, the question arises to what extent birth control has had a eugenic effect upon the Negro race. If any question should remain about Sanger's racist agenda, a 1939 letter she wrote to Dr. Clarence Gamble should remove all doubt. We should hire three or four colored ministers, preferably with social service backgrounds and with engaging personalities. The most successful educational approach to the Negro is through a religious appeal. We don't want the word to go out that we want to exterminate the Negro population. And the minister is a man who can straighten out that idea if it ever occurs to any of their more rebellious members. Can there be any wonder why Planned Parenthood opens its facilities